every architect, irrespective of his talents, gets an opportunity to you know, leave his marks on the earth. So our philosophy is that architecture should respond uh, to the site, context, of course then the climate of the site and, and the time. It should belong to the time in which it is built. When you think of a circuit house, what comes to your mind? A chaos. Because you know, circuit house, uh, uh, the, the occupants, the users are normally VIPs. So in most of circuit houses, the conventional designs, you'll find that it's all chaotic situation because of this. So it was important to take care of uh, circulation and zoning of this building. And that was uh, one of the challenge for us. Architectural spaces should be in harmony with the nature. This space merges with the outside space, you know, and there is a hierarchy of spaces like that. In indoor spaces, then buffer spaces and outdoor spaces. So my basic philosophy is that it should not be a closed air-conditioned box. The spaces should be in harmony with the nature. They should flow out and that's how architecture should be. Basically, when we started designing this project, uh, right from day one we knew that we have to design a green building because we had this thing in mind that we need to change the definition of uh, government building. On that front, we knew that to do a green building, it has to be a collaborative effort, it has to be a team effort, along with the client, the consultants, us, and even the contractor. As far as the style is concerned, we believe that uh, this should be contemporary vernacular architecture. So according to the climate of Pune, the building is designed and each facade responds to the orientation. And also it has those vertical louvers, so it takes care of the sun whenever it's there. There is a water body in the courtyard, there is a landscape in the courtyard. So this water body acts as a evaporative cooling technique. Overall the building has become light because of AAC blocks, so we have saved a lot on a structural steel which is uh, which needed to be used in the building. We have used double glazed windows for the uh, facades and each glass is according to the orientation. Again the water which is used in the building is getting recycled with the help of STP and that is getting used for the irrigation of the building and we have used all native plants in the landscapes. Uh, the energy performance of the building is 42% lower than the benchmark. I am proud and very happy to say that this building has earned that 5 star rating from Griha which is the first PWD building of Maharashtra. Mm -hmm.